Well, welcome to Hopwork Organ Build uh, lesson number two. This is the back of a uh, manual from a actual church organ. And what we have here is this is a uh, Casio keyboard. Now you'll notice that there are two assemblies here. And what I'll do is I'll zoom up on one and show you that this connection goes to a circuit board down here. And that circuit board is underneath this bar. The bar is very important because it holds the circuit board up against the keys so that the uh, uh, circuit board can sense the movement of the keys. Now the little rubber things on the circuit board that take the movement and make the MIDI signal uh, are all perfectly lined up and they're lined up with a piece of uh, 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 steel that came with the organ for another function and also a crossbar here and then there's a U-channel underneath that holds that circuit board perfectly in place and once you've got the circuit board held against the keys here's what happens etc etc it works just perfectly and when you feed the output from this through a USB into a computer you can run a hop work synthesized organ. So uh, it took me uh, not a lot of time to modify these things and the Casio keyboards cost about uh, 70 to 90 dollars each so it gives you a scope on things you just gotta get yourself a organ console and uh, three or four manuals and you can make the same adaptation. The pedal board is a little bit more difficult as you have to solder 31 connections to the pedals and bring them to the circuit boards from the Casio.